Hi, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Geek Chasers. I'm Adrian, and this week we will focus on June 23rd through the 29th. Um, I just finished filming a vlog, and I want you to know when I say to please subscribe, I mean it because the vlog is on a different YouTube channel, so it's not under the normal Geek Chasers channel. It still should be connected. Although, if you click on the link I give on Facebook um, and go to YouTube, it will take you to that actual channel. Just saying, just saying. I hope you guys subscribe. All right, we're going to move on to some topics. All right, we're going to move on to video games. And to be honest, there's only one I'm going to talk about, so deal with it. It is Deadpool being released on June 25th, finally. It's been very much waited for and anticipated. Before starting, this game is rated M for Mature, so parents, please make sure you look things over before running out and buying it for your kids. Just because it's a superhero doesn't mean it's for the little ones. Just saying. So, everyone is familiar with the foul Mouth Mercenary that Marvel released back in 91. In this game, Deadpool is hired to take out a news reporter gone wrong named Chance White. This is a third-person action game, and Deadpool gains his moves as he progresses, which is normal. You see that all the time. Of course, melee and shooting is involved, with huge emphasis on hammers, size, swords, and, of course, guns. Uh, the fun thing about this is, besides Deadpool himself, is the script being written by Daniel Way, who has written many Deadpool comics. Um, and don't think Deadpool will be the only familiar face being seen. We have Marvel characters appearing, such as Wolverine, Cable, Rogue, Red Hulk, and of course, many, many more. This game is available for the Xbox 360, the PS3, and the PC. Yes, I adjusted the camera. I kept feeling like my head was being chopped off, so ignore the, the jump. Anyway, we're going to go on to comics. Um, I'm very excited about this one. Being a huge Superman and Batman fan, this is very exciting for me. It is Batman Superman number one. This comes out June 26th. And for me, I love when movies or comics harp on Superman and Batman having that, that special friendship. Um, this comic isn't guaranteeing that yet, but it's a start. Uh, this comic starts with the meeting of these two great heroes, and make sure you keep your eyes peeled for more. Another great one from DC Comics, Lara Freeze number one. He was first seen in Blackest Night and last seen in Threshold. He's back with his own deserved comic to chase down Loward of the Hunt a pan-dimensional cosmic entity that is hunting the universe for his own satisfaction. Now, this next comic seems a bit confusing, to say the least. It's called Lazarus No. 1, and it's brought to you by Image Comics. It's about a near-future government that has the law of possession. It is 100% the law. A woman by the name of Forever Carlisle is her family's protector of everything that is theirs. Here's where things get weird. The fact that Diamond Comics is stating once forever is shot dead, her day goes downhill from there. Questions? Concerns? This one's definitely one that you're going to have to read to find out. There isn't any number one comics from Marvel. So we're going to move on to Blockbusters. And I saw a long preview for this in theaters last week while seeing Man of Steel. Um, and it's actually my kind of movie. It's called White House Down. Um, it's got a lot of action with comedy thrown everywhere, and that's what I love. We have stars like Channing Tatum and Jamie Foxx. Fox is our president, and Tatum is a Capitol policeman that was recently turned down from the Secret Service. He's very sad. Um, he ends up, Tatum ends up taking his daughter on a tour of the White House, and it's taken over by a paramilitary group. 
Of course, it's somehow up to Tatum to save our president and country. This is rated PG-13, and it is worth a shot. It looks really entertaining. And that is all, folks. Um, it's like the, the pig. That's all, folks. I can't do that well at all. But um, I'm going to go. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Like and share. It's not hard to do. And please subscribe. It'll make me so happy. I just scratched my chin. But I will see you guys next week. Bye.